Hey guys, this is Amjavid with another tutorial whether how we can edit, inactive, and or delete a customer profile in QuickBooks Desktop. Well, there comes a time when we find ourselves in a position to change, inactive, and in a worst case scenario, delete a customer profile. There might be various reasons to inactive or delete a customer profile, but doing so, it keeps our customers list precise and up to date to those we are doing our business with regularly and consistently. So to edit inactive and delete a customer profile, first let me add a customer profile with as little info as possible. Well, when a customer moves from one area to another, or for some reason his basic information changes, he wants his vendors to update his profile. So to edit a customer's profile, either right click on the customer's name and select edit customer job. It will open the customer's profile window. Or you can click on this pencil icon. Either way, you will end up here and whatever the info he wants you to update, just go through and change it and then click on OK. Well, sometimes you don't do your business with a customer as frequently as you think it will be or due to some unexpected reasons, the customer never comes back. In that scenario, you get a choice to keep that customer showing up in your customer's list or you can just inactive that customer to keep the customer's list to those you do your business with regularly. Let's say you want to inactive that customer. So either click on the pencil icon again and check this checkbox to inactive that customer or right click on the customer's name and select make customer job inactive. Either way the customer's profile will get inactive and if that customer comes back to do the business again all you need to do is to click on this drop down and select all customers. It will start showing all the customers whether they are active or inactive. Here, the ones you see cross next to them are the inactive ones. And to make a customer active again, either select make customer job active option by right clicking on it or just click on the cross sign to reappear that customer in the list. And then just select active customers in the drop down to start your business with that customer again. Well, for some reasons, if you really have to delete a customer profile from your QuickBooks desktop, you sure can. Just right click on the customer's name and select delete customer job. And then click on OK to delete that customer. The customer profile will get deleted conveniently if there is no transaction attached to this customer. Well, if there is, the QuickBooks will not let you delete that customer. To make it clear, I'm opening a sample file and adding a customer profile there. Now I am creating an invoice relevant to that customer. Now we have some data attached to this customer. And if you want to delete that customer, it will show a message mentioning that this customer has some balance. That's why the customer can't be deleted. Instead, it's letting you know, just make that customer inactive if you don't do your business with this customer anymore. Anyhow, if you really have to delete the customer profile from your QuickBooks, you can either by deleting the attached transaction or assigning those transactions to another customer. Here you can see that the concerned transaction is no longer attached to this customer and now we can delete that customer conveniently. Remember, if you even void that transaction, the QuickBooks will not let you delete that customer because it will still consider that there is some transaction attached to this customer. Anyhow, deleting a customer's profile by assigning the transactions to another customer is not the best practice and it should be avoided and I hope this will be helpful for someone out there and thanks for watching.